Hey guys, John from Shine On here. Uh, I'm really excited today. We are going to launch a new feature and tool for the Shine On platform. Uh, this is something that we've been getting at, at your requests about for the last year since the platform started. It took some maneuvering to figure out how we were going to actually do it and what added the most value for you guys as sellers. So what we are launching today is our discounts feature. Uh, this is a feature that allows you to add coupon codes to your product pages and allows you to be a little more dynamic in how you do your marketing. So, you know, how you choose to market this, if you tie it in with the coupon code, can be in a very effective way of converting customers. It's not to say it's going to work the best for your product, but it's something that you can experiment with and see what does work. So let's go ahead and get into it. Over here on the left nav, you are going to see discounts. Easy enough. Here you're going to see a list of all of the price rules that we have available to you. Um, under each price rule, you will see a list of codes that are available in that price rule. So what we have is we have a $15 off, a $10 off, a $5 off, and then we also have 20%. 15%, 10%, and 5%. And as you can see, there's about 10 codes for each uh, price rule here. So you can choose to use any of those. Um, so let's go ahead and you know, there's not much else to, to get into here. Um, I am gonna come back to this for an advanced feature at the end of this video. But for now, um, this is the base view you're gonna get. And these are the codes that are available. I personally am gonna create a uh, engagement present and I'm going to give a $15 off coupon. The coupon is engagement and this is a, um, my message card doesn't actually say it. I'm just imagining in my head what I'm giving it is an engagement gift. So like my daughter got engaged, I'm going to give her a gift. Um, so what I've created is this project right or this product right here. And this is our new sweetest hearts. Awesome. Um, and as you can see, currently the way it's set up is if you do one heart in sterling silver, it's uh, it was fifty nine ninety five, and it is now thirty nine ninety five, and you're getting twenty dollars off. So I'm going to get fifteen dollars off, but I still think the the price of thirty nine ninety five is what I want the customer to end up paying. So um, if I add fifteen dollars to thirty nine ninety five. I'm at $54.95 rather than $59.95. So we'll, we'll get into that later. But let's go ahead over here and go to our product, uh, engagement test. So currently, as you saw, the pricing is $59.95 and $39.95. So I want to come straight down here to the pricing and I want to, we're just going to deal with this one variant. You'd have to go through and do all the variants, but I don't want to go spend too much time on this. It's just repetitive. But what I want to do is um, I no longer care about a compare price. This is no longer going to show when we do a discount. All it's going to show is our main price. So as I said, I want this to be $15 higher because I'm giving a $15 coupon. And so that my end result is that $39.95 price. But that's what I actually want to be selling this at. So I've adjusted this to $54.95 and I'm going to save it. So then, um, and you would do the same for all of these. That would be the concept that you would follow. Then once I come over here, you're gonna see a display coupon section that's showing up on all of your uh, product edit pages. So here, I want to find engagement right there. So I get a $15 off with code engagement. And what you see is a preview of what's actually gonna show up on your product page. There's a box here and it says, get an extra $15 off, use code engagement, enter code at checkout. So I'm gonna save that. That's the code we wanna use. Um, that's what we're gonna offer people. And I'm gonna structure my Facebook ad to talk all about getting $15 off by using this code. So um, you know, I don't need the product page to do the selling. We have this block here to remind them. The sell income from how I build my ad. So now that we have done this, let's go ahead and uh, we're going to view this in the store and see what it looks like now. 
So, what you're going to see now is right here above the add to the cart page, there is a get an extra 15% off, use code engagement, enter code at checkout. Uh, no matter what product you choose to sell, this is the location that this block is going to show up. The hope is it's it's drawing their eye to the add to the cart button. They're seeing, I'm going to get $15 off. I should hit and go to the next step. So, you know, the hope is this is where it's helping to just get them straight through the product page quickly and get them into the checkout process. And they're hopefully likely to get further through the checkout process because at some point they get to put in a code and get a discount. So um, this is what it's going to look like. So you can see it's $54.95 and I'm getting $15 off by using this code. So it comes down to $39.95. Uh, so let's go ahead and add to cart. No, well, I guess I need to add to cart here. Let me remove stuff that I had previously. And then I need to enter my code. So I need to go to checkout. So that hope is they go straight past this and into checkout. We're over here. They didn't already have a one from an old test. Type in engagement, apply, and $15 off. Hopefully, this helps to get them through checkout. Again, this is something you're going to have to test, but it's a tool for you guys to use and see what works. Um, there's, there's not a perfect game plan for, for how to use this. So um, let's go ahead and, and go back to this product page. We've seen how checkout works. I, I just want to show you, the, again, the comparison of what with using a coupon versus not using a coupon, you're going to see. So with a coupon, you get your price. So this is your final price. This is the price you you want them to pay. And then they're going to get $15 off of that price. So $54.95 minus $15, you're getting that $39.95. So if we go to our traditional non-discount page, $39.95 is that price. Whereas before we had it as $54.95. And they're getting the discount here by using that compare at price. That compare at price no longer shows up for the discount. So when you use a coupon, we just show them the main price. And, and so that's where they're getting the discount is the actual getting to use a code. So um, it's something we're excited to see how you guys utilize. And we're, you know, we've built it in a way to try and limit the issues that we can have with having coupon codes on our site. So we're, we're doing what we can to prevent, you know, overuse and things of like that, like by giving a large amount of codes and we can constantly be refreshing those codes and bringing you new ones. So going back, um, I do want to cover one advanced feature. If you are a platform seller that has reached a threshold um, of a certain level of sales, we make a feature available to you inside of this that is called the request discount button. So up here in the top right on the discount page, you'll see request discount. What it's going to do is it's going to trigger you to email me. Um, and when you email me, you're requesting a coupon. So you might say, hey, I want to use the coupon family gift and I want it to be for $30 off. And I can go and I can create that. And, and basically what you can do is you say, I want customers to be able to use this on all of my products, or I want this discount to only be used on this one single product uh, of yours, obviously. And, and so this is you know helping to allow you to add a, another layer of personalization that can match Maybe the, the ads you're running better, match the creatives you're doing better, um, the copy and the message card. This just gives you a, a little bit of an extra ability to customize this feature to work for you. Um, again, we only are offering this at a um, top level um, of platform seller at this point, just because it is a manual process for me to go and create those codes. So I have to limit um, the amount that I'm doing for that. 
Uh, we're hoping in the future to find a way to make this more widely available, but it was a highly requested thing. And unfortunately, the only way we could feasibly do it was to put some limits on it. So those limits do exist, um, but I'm hoping most of you will eventually reach those thresholds and then be able to use this feature. Uh, but that is the discount feature in a nutshell. Um, one thing I should care to mention is that when you get your email of you got a platform sale, it will list the coupon that was used in the email. Uh, when it says, hey, you had an order and your profit's $23, it'll say discount um, engagement. And you know that's why they got $15 off. They use that coupon. You can refer back to here and see what coupons, you know, so if someone's using a random coupon, you can let me know. Um, but that's where you'll go to see what that coupon is. So that's the discounts feature. Um, we're going to be uh, releasing a bunch of documentation here soon, all about this feature, walkthroughs on how to use it besides this video. And we'll probably do some more in-depth um, discussions on how to match it with marketing coming out in the near future. Um, if you do have any questions, feel free to reach out to the support team. We're all trained on this and excited to help everybody out. And, um, you know, let us know how it goes. Have a great one.